My name is Ida. I'm from Indonesia. At home, I've got a job at uni teaching English literature. I'm currently studying at the University of Wollongong. Hi. What are you doing? My study is sponsored by Australian government. There are many things I love about Australia. The nature in Australia is fantastic. The blue sky, the clean beaches, the smell of the gum tree. Yeah, those things are really heaven for me. I came to Wollongo with my husband and my son. Oh yeah, let's go. That's cool. <laughs> I'm very active in Indonesian Student Association. Selamat pagi. Okay. I enjoy speaking with the students in the high school. Two, three. When there is an upcoming event of summon dance, we practice almost every afternoon. Uh, I can laugh when we make a mistake in a dance. <laughs> When I have a chance to study in Australia, one of my wishes at, at that time is that I can get in, engaged with Aboriginal people. I'm going to learn uh, Aboriginal painting. I've never uh, done any painting at all in my life. I'm a little bit nervous. <laughs> I'm afraid that uh, my painting will be bad. But my, my excitement to learn about Aboriginal arts like beat everything. Hello. <laughs> Hello. I'm Ida. Nice How to you meet you. Ida? Good, thank Good. you. I'm, yourself? I'm Lorraine. Yeah. I'm Lorraine. Hi, Lorraine. Yeah. Nice to meet you too. Ida, we're, we're the Kumidichi Artist Cooperative. We paint and we work with a lot of students, a lot of people that want to know about Aboriginal culture, Aboriginal art. It's a way of um, contacting with other people. It's like a bridge to other communities and for them to get an understanding of Aboriginal people and Aboriginal culture. You know, so we make it presentable for them so that... I really want to tell my story through painting about my experience living and uh, coming and living in Australia at the moment since the Bali bomb, uh, the reaction of, of um, the world community has already has changed uh, through, uh, to, toward Islam or toward Muslim. Oh, yes. I feel that uh, some Australian people uh, see my hijab uh, as a as a prevention for them to get to get know more about me. I feel a little bit like disturbed with that. If they don't <laughs> know me, how, how can they, they judge? If I can express my experience um, as a Muslim living in Australia through Abor Aboriginal painting, that would be great. Oh, I feel so excited, <laughs> you know, meeting with um, Norel and Lorraine and talks to them directly face to face. That's, that's what I, you know, my wish so far when, but before I came to Australia. I told them that I'm going to tell about my experience living here. Like, I found that um, some Australian people might have uh, you know, certain prejudice towards uh, people who wear hijab, and they, yeah, they thought that they still um, judge people from their appearance. I think we've got an understanding of what she's going through, and when she stated the kind of artwork she wanted to do to sort of get it out there, that she's just as normal as anybody else, and for people not to have fear of her, I thought, well, that's a good thing, because it's like us trying to get our community better known, you know, instead of people making judgments about us. Did she bring it in level with that? We've got similarities in our life, Aboriginal people and Muslims. Yeah. We, we experience prejudice, we experience uh, racism. So I found that an interesting story because uh, I can share my experience, my feeling to them. I look forward to express that in my painting. <laughs> Hello, I'm Ida. Nice to meet you. My granddaughter, sorry. 
Oh, oke, okay. nice to meet you. <laughs> the title of my painting is My Journey. Wow. It tells about yes, my journey from Indonesia to Australia and the the journey is represented by the footprints from Indonesia to Australia. And today, my wish come true. <laughs> I feel so happy. <laughs> yeah. I talk with Lorraine and Narelle in a very in a quite intimate way. Like uh, we share our story. I share my my feeling to them, my experience to them, and uh, to my surprise, uh, we've got quite similar uh, experience. We've got one thing one thing in common that uh, um, about this the the idea of prejudice. Uh, that happened between me as a Muslim and them as the traditional people in Australia. I feel more empathy and solidarity with them. Yeah. And you're happy with it? I'm really happy, more than happy. Okay, thank you very much for thank a good time. Thank you very much. You. <laughs> really good, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I think it came together really well. Um, it just comes from Indonesia and She, show, she has shown herself and who she is by painting herself in the fair smack bang in the middle of Australia. We are, we are a multicultural country and we have been for a long time. I think the painting turned out good. Um, Edith said she couldn't paint, but put a few ideas together and working with me and my sister and, and um, sort of working out how she wanted to explain it and how she wanted people to get the message. And I think the paintings turned out really good. I'm really pleased with it. I feel very happy. Uh, I've never thought that I can paint it that beautiful. If Lorraine and Narel didn't help me, maybe that would not be that beautiful. <laughs> so I feel really excited about that. I'm very happy with my painting because it is more beautiful than I imagined before. <laughs> <laughs>